Blackberry Key 2 Unboxings and First Impressions coming up right now. So what is up guys? Nick here helping you to master your technology. Blackberry Key 2 Unboxings and First Impressions video. Now Blackberry Key 1 is a little bit over a year old now and here we have the Blackberry Key 2. Let's take a look at the specs on the rear you have yourself a 4.5 inch ips display 434 ppi octa core cpu we're going to get into this more feature in depth in the full review i'm going to have that ready for you in about a week so be sure to leave your questions down below but you can read this on a spec sheet online somewhere or you can just pause and read it right now but really what we want to see here is the device so let's go ahead and open this up and you could see Blackberry Key 2, just a nice black box. Kind of reminds me of those Samsung boxes like on the Galaxy series. So let's go ahead and open this up and see what we do reveal in the case. So there it is, the Blackberry Key 2. Now I actually decided to skip out on the Key 1 last year just because I wasn't really interested. But this year I kind of like what I'm seeing with this new Blackberry Key 2. It just has a cleaner look has a nicer rear camera and blackberry is actually not the same as they used to be they're now operated by tcl communication under the brand of blackberry mobile so blackberry used to be run and operated by rim research in motion no longer so now it runs android which is much better because you have access to all the android applications so let's go ahead and peel the front off once in a lifetime i kind of like how they put the logo right there you don't really see that on a lot of other smartphone stickers so peeling that off, that wasn't too, too stickery, if you know what I mean, but let's go ahead and peel this off the back. And you could see, I really like what they did here with this back. It kind of has got like a mesh feel to it. Um, it's, it's pretty grippy. And then you have like this, you know, like this metal looking plastic around the sides. It's a very nice look. This is going to fall more in a mid-ranger style of smartphone though, but it does have some specs that can rival a flagship. Let's go ahead and I think this is the power button right here. So let's go ahead and turn this on and uh, see if we got any juice on the device and we do it says blackberry powered by android and while we're powering that up let's see what comes in the box of this device and we're going to open that up and see what's in here so we do have a blackberry charger this should be fast charging i'll let you know more about that in the full review we do have some blackberry branded headphones so that's a nice touch you got the little logo right there on the headphones and we do have ourselves which should be a USB-C cord, which it is, USB-C cord right there. And then we have some packaging right here that should go ahead and reveal to us warranty information, stuff like that. Welcome, quick start guide, stuff like that. You know when we'll read this, number two. Let's go over here and you see, I could always use another one of these SIM card tools. So yeah, that's basically it. That's what comes with the device. Let's file this off to the side and get back into that BlackBerry key two so it is booting up right now i'm gonna go ahead and just log in my information and we'll check it out a little bit further okay so i'm now in the device and you could see right off the bat it looks very similar in terms of that software to what you had on the key one which was to be expected it's a very clean kind of like stock like experience with a few blackberry add-ons this is so much better than the rim version of blackberries i used to have the bold I disliked that software because of the application but with the play store on board there's just so much going on and a few add-ons here you get the radio you get the password keeper and you get you know blackberry camera here and you also get the productivity tab and you know that i'm really into productivity but we'll talk more about these features in more you know long form more in depth in the review but really i'm liking what i'm seeing so far going into settings if we go into system and we go to system updates you can see that the system is up to date let's go ahead and just take a quick photo just to see one little sample we're not going to do anything really you know significant right here but let me just go ahead and take a sample and let's see what that camera looks like because you wouldn't expect a great camera on a phone that's geared towards productivity but i'm liking my first little picture i took so far not bad but i think this is really going to appeal to enterprise users as well as people who want to do business on their phone and people that really just love the blackberry you know brand they just really love blackberry phones and 
they're sad to see that they went away. Well, they didn't really fully go away. They just got sold off. And uh, now they're making some Android BlackBerry phones. And I kind of like this whole thing. I think it works better than that old operating system. Now you can see that you do have some shiny buttons on here. Again, we're not going to go too in depth, but just giving you a first look. It's a beautiful little phone especially considering that you have actually no glass really on here besides the front you don't really have anything that feels anything like the other android phones it's a very unique device taking a closer look at that keyboard a very spacious keyboard much more spacious than some of the previous blackberry devices and overall the ability to have a touchscreen and a physical keyboard is something you're just not going to find on any other smartphone you have a dual camera here on the back that's nice to see and it's a clean look we don't have any carrier brand or anything like that this is an unlocked model so you can see everything is clean i'm really just liking this whole productivity businessy look of the blackberry key 2 but anyway i'm not going to talk too much more about it here i'm going to save my thoughts for the full review but questions do you have any questions on this phone what would you like to know what would you like to see in the full review go ahead and leave that down below in the comment section of this video i will take a lot of your feedback all of it very seriously so make sure you do that i'm gonna leave my sim card in here and i'm gonna give you the full rundown on this phone in about a week so you might want to be subscribed for that this is my blackberry key to unboxings and first impressions first impressions i'm liking what i'm seeing so far feels productive feels like it offers enough for the everyday use and it feels like it's going to be slotted in my rotation at least as a businessy class device if you found this video helpful enjoyable entertaining informing in any way shape and form go ahead and click that like button for me and if you're new here consider subscribing for more nick here helping you to master your technology be sure to have a great day be sure to be well and peace